All right, it is time to put your Mighty Network on automation autopilot. So here we go, go to manage, scroll down to premium features, and all the way to the very bottom, click on Zapier. And now this is my API key. So you're gonna wanna copy that and you'll use that when building your account within Zapier. So close this and let's head over to Zapier. So you're gonna wanna create an account if you don't already have one. I already have one, but I'll go through the whole sign up process with you for any of you newbies here. So we're gonna create the account and we'll make a new one for Magic Media. Enter the name. I'm the boss and here we go. So we're gonna go to finish setup for right now and we can choose all the different things that we're gonna use in a few minutes. So now you wanna connect this app. So we're gonna connect it to Mighty Networks and let's do our first zap, which is gonna be actually hooking up an autoresponder when somebody joins your Mighty Network. So this one, uh, we use Active Campaign. This could be MailChimp. This could be any number. So we're gonna say a new member and we're gonna select an action, add contact to create new contact. So that's the one that we're gonna go with. You're gonna use this zap and presto, we're making some magic right now. So we're gonna select the Mighty Network account. And here's the API key that we copy and pasted from earlier. Yes, continue. Save and continue. So you always wanna make sure um, that you're using the most recent version of what Mighty Networks has uploaded here. Set up options. So let's just say they join the network. But let's say it wasn't the network. Let's say it was a group or a course that they joined. Well, the exact same process we're going through right now to add them to your main Mighty Network, which is gonna in turn add them to your email list. This is the same thing you would do for adding them to a group or adding them to a course. So if you can add them to your network, then you can add them to either of those two things as well. But for this one, let's just go with the network. So bam, continue. And that same process would be if they joined a course or they joined a group. Continue. Now we're gonna go into the active campaign side of things and start to set up what happens when they join. So we're creating a new contact we could also add them to an automation if that was another, but I'll show you how to get to that in just a moment. So we'll go continue, we'll connect our account, and now we have to go get our API key inside of our active campaign account. You'll have to do this inside of whatever service you're using, whether it's MailChimp or ConvertKit or Infusionsoft. So let's go do that. And if you don't know how to do that, just Google search how to find API key with MailChimp, with ConvertKit, whatever one you're using. So inside of Active Campaign, you wanna to go to Developer, click on that, and here's the API key here that I'm gonna copy and paste. Now I'll bring that back over, copy that in, and copy the URL, which is right here. Now we're ready to go. Just like magic, we're now in business over here. So now, all you gotta do is choose which list you wanna add them to. So for us, I'm gonna add them to the, we'll add them to that list. You want to find their email address, so I'm just going to go email. This is just a sample so that the system knows how to use it. You can either go first name, last name, or full name, and we'll do first and last name. And there's a bunch of other ones that you can do, but for right now, we're not going to bother with that. We'll send a test to active campaign, and once you've done that, press finish.
So now you name it, you turn on the zap, and bam, every single time somebody joins your Mighty Network, they'll automatically be added to your email list. Now, you can also, if you wanted to, you could add them to an automation. So if you have a free course that you're wanting them to join or go through, so let's just do that. Let's add them to that. So now you wanna add them to an automation. Press continue. Choose the account, so same thing. Now we're gonna choose which automation we're gonna go with. Let's just go with uh, eCourse Games. Subscriber email, same thing. And here you go. As you can see, it's so easy to work with Zapier once you know what you're trying to do. We actually have a whole section of our great eCourse adventure course on automations and doing different types of tags and, and that that we're doing here so that you can figure out the best automation sequences. So there you go though. This is gonna get you started. You can now automate when somebody joins your Mighty Network, it adds them to a list and it sends out the correct automation that you wanna do. So go do that if you weren't following along right now and I'll see you in the next video tutorial where we learn a little bit more about Zapier.